So I have uh, Motor Brett from Dallas, and he said, what happens with sodium bromide that it eats so much chlorine? Is there anything that you can do to combat that so it doesn't eat as much chlorine? Okay, the, the short answer to the latter part is no. <laughs> the only thing you can do is drain it. Um, and here's what happens, it, it doesn't, his question is based on the end result, but the chemical thing of what happens is you get bromide in the pool. That happens because most people don't don't realize this, but when they buy one of these uh, algicides that's based on sodium bromide, and uh -huh. and you can see on the label, the it'll say the active ingredient is sodium bromide. Mm -hmm. and what that does is it. When you put it in water, it's like sodium chloride. It's the sodium bromide, it's a salt. You put it mm -hmm. in water, it comes apart into a sodium and a bromide, just like salt comes into, goes into sodium ions and chloride ions. So the bromide ions can be activated or reacted with chlorine or an oxidizer. And when the bromide ions see chlorine or an oxidizer, they get oxidized to hypobromous acid, H-O-B-R, mm -hmm. which is the same thing as H-O-C-L, but for bromine. H-O-B-R, mm -hmm. hypobromous acid is the killing form of bromine. So anytime there is any bromide in the water, all the chlorine you add to the pool converts bromide into hypobromous acid. And then now what's killing things in your pool is bromine. Mm -hmm. And so you have switched your pool to a bromine pool. And the reason you're using so much chlorine is because it's switching that bromine or that bromide to bromine. Bromine in water, cyanuric acid doesn't work for that. So right. so the the bromine in the water can be destroyed by the sunlight and the degradation rate for bromine in water is 65% in two hours. So if you, 65%, if you had five parts per million or 10 parts per million of, of bromide in the pool, 65% uh, uh -huh. of it will be gone in two hours, and then 65% of that will be gone the next two hours. So in about five hours, you go to zero, and, and that doesn't happen with chlorine. It happens if you have no cyanuric acid in the water, uh -huh. you go to zero chlorine in four hours, and probably with bromine about five hours. But there's protection for chlorine. There isn't any protection for uh, bromine, and you will continue to have a bromine pool until you have zero brom bromide in the water. And bromide recycles when you make uh, you know yourself already, when you put chlorine in water, you make HOCl. And when mm -hmm. it's finished being HOCl, it becomes part of TDS as a chloride ion. And we can regenerate that uh, if we apply enough energy to it, like we do with a chlorine generator, we can make more chlorine. Um, bromide is l a lower molecular weight and a lower energy, so we can actually activate it with chlorine. So. Uh -huh. Um, and it recycles. So HOBr, when it's finished being HOBr, it goes back to Br minus. And the next time you mm -hmm. put chlorine in, that Br minus becomes HOBr again. It just keeps it's recycling. Yeah. And it stays there until the bromide gets out of the water. And that only happens when you drain part of the pool, when you when you uh, drag out or or splash out of the water, and it stays there till it's gone. And the, the manufacturers of the algicides that have sodium bromide in it don't tell you that. No, and, no, and no. I have, so there is a question about then is there a test for, um, is there a test for whether there's bromine or chlorine in the pool? And mm -hmm. you can do that in the lab, but you can't really do it at poolside. Can't do that but, poolside. but, um, I have written a tech bulletin. What's in your pool, chlorine or bromine? And I have 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 uh, a printed method 
okay. and how you can figure out if there's bromine or chlorine in your pool. And, right. and that, that tech bulletin is available for free on my website at pcti.online, pcti.online, yep. and then you can click on tech bulletin and then scroll down to what's in your pool, bromine or chlorine, and you can read it for free online or you can download it as a PDF.